Hey YouTube, um, this is Pierre with Fish Aquarium. Um, I'm doing an update video on my fish tank, but today the focus will be on the filtration system. So I'm just showing around um, so I can see um, the fish in the tank. And for those who follow my channel, um, y'all yeah, probably familiar with this tank in question. Um, where I have a couple Oscars and Jack Dempsey's, um, Mighty Cichlid, two juvenile Mighty Cichlid, some catfish. So, like I said, my filtration system, you can see um, I have uh, a sponge attached to my canister filter. And I'm running... Uh, Marilyn C360 and another one on the side the C360 um, the older model so and I keep my tank um, filtrate and these pad out here that I'm showing you um, got it from Walmart uh, square foot and I just cut them up and make it fit in my canister filter. You can see how thick that is. And I have another sponge over here that I also bought from Walmart um, that I cut up and double those and put in my canister filter to help like improve uh, the filtration of the tank. And on top of that, I make a three wire change um, a week. 25% and a 50% water change due to the quantity of fish I have in this um, aquarium. So, and I don't know why the fish are all on the side, but this is my 125 gallon tank and with my system. And I will show you in a second another tank. Um, so y'all can probably see uh, the filtration system on that one. And here we're going to the back room, another sponge on my canister filter. Um, as you can see, uh, I'm filling the tank right back. Um, I made a water change on this tank today. Um, and the Oscar peeking on each other again on the tank. So, remember the pad that I mentioned? Uh, oh, it's kind of hard to see. Uh, let me take, let me turn the light on right quick. And as you can see, um, after I turn the light on, those are the pads that I put inside my filter. And um, I kind of put them at the level where if you get kind of like stuff up, the water don't overflow. It's just go over it and... Um, don't create any problem and so you gotta make sure that you clean those pads too you don't just leave them like that on um, your tank so as you can see um the fish doing pretty well um i feel the water in the tank a little bit because i made a water change today and so you can see all the mighty swimming around um in the tank so um, I have this Picasumus over here um, that is pretty large um, so I will measure measure him and for you so y'all can probably see it. let me grab a measure tape okay so I have a measure tape and as you can see um, it's about 12 inches top to bottom and the costume is kind of sideways on the glass so you can probably see and uh, estimate um, how big it is and stuff in the tank. So, and I'm just trying to get them as big as I can. Hopefully, um, when I can clear this tank from all this uh, Midas fry and sell them, um, that will give him plenty of room um, to grow. So, 
So I'm Pierre with Fish Aquarium, and thank you for watching. Um, if you have any questions about your filtration, um, how I did it, and where I got my material from, just leave me a comment, um, and I will get back to you um, as soon as I can. And if you didn't subscribe to my channel, please do subscribe. And um, if you like my video, um, press the like button. If you don't like it, dislike button um, and leave a comment why you don't like what you see so